Greetings. What I thought I'd do is share a quick video upload of my simple way to run your home furnace off a portable generator. What you can see here is I've got some conduit coming down and uh, conduit is code up here in northeastern Illinois but I've got the um, hot which is a red wire <clears throat> and the neutral which is a white coming down into this box. Um, this is the standard switch where I can turn it on and off and this little door opens to a 15 amp old school fuse which must be code because that's in addition to a dedicated 15 amp circuit breaker. So all I've simply done is I've taken this hot and neutral and I've uh, using wire nuts connected it to this cord right here uh, to this female plug and then it passes through this male plug uh, back into the box where I wired together the um, <clears throat> the neutrals for the furnace and the humidifier and the um, and then the uh, the hot which goes through this fuse and then after the fuse uh, to the furnace and to the humidifier and uh, so this is how it would be uh, operating normally uh, when I have power from ComEd. Um, in the event of a power outage, what I would simply do is unplug this. And so it's completely disconnected. And now my furnace runs off this stubby cord. And so I would simply take my uh, generator, um, connect it to an extension cord, a heavy gauge, and then connect the cord to this, and voila. And I can confirm that um, I'm not going to backfeed the house or outside of the house because um, I have a complete disconnect here. Uh, this is only connected to the furnace and to the humidifier. Now in terms of how many watts you need, I took out the off, off the cover here and I saw that the max amperage is 10.2 and of course 120 volts that's like 1244 watts um, at startup and uh, a small generator uh, would be able to handle that. So again, this is uh, the simple way to uh, set up your furnace to uh, run off a generator. It costs about $15, about $5.50 for the male, $5.50 for the female, and then about maybe $2.50 for two feet of cord, a couple wire nuts, a couple of these fittings here, and uh, that's it. All right, thanks.